Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So today I thought I would split up my binders a bit and I am going to be updating my two A5 binders. So I'm going to be updating my Wanas Lido binder and I'm going to be updating my 17 Minghao binder. And I thought this would be good since they are both A5 size. Um, I thought it would be like kind of easier to follow compared to me doing a whole photo card storing video for all of my binders. And so the first thing that I wanted to do is I wanted to show all of the photo cards that I am going to put away. These six is just for the purpose of the thumbnail. It's not all of the photo cards. So I have a lot more here. These are all Lido photo cards. Because um, for Lido, I do collect all of his album photo cards and then a lot of pre-order benefits as well. And then I have another small pile here of Lido so these are all of the Malice pre-order benefits. And then you can kind of see on the table, I have a few Minghao photo cards and a few more Lido photo cards. And I am going to actually start off with something that's not really photo card related, but it's binder related. And I actually wanted to update the charms that I put onto my binders. Um, so I'll move the photo cards aside and I'm gonna update the charms that I put on the side of the Beyond Deep binders. All right, so I've moved everything aside and I just have my two binders here now. And the first thing I wanted to do is I wanted to update the Lido binder. Um, so the Lido binder, as you can see, the Beyond D has this kind of hole here where you can put a charm. And I made these, both of these charms. So they are just uh, pretty cute little beaded charms. But as you guys may know, both Lido and Minghao and most idols, they have kind of their representative animal and I just happen to be lucky enough to get both of their animals. So for Lido, it's a chick. So this chick I actually had for a really long time. It's from the ramen shop in Osaka, the ramen factory. Um, so I bought this one and I'm going to put it on to Lido's binder. All right, so we've removed the old one. I'm gonna reuse the beads for this. And we're going to put the new one on. So the new one is this really, really cute little chick, the mascot of Cup Ramen in Japan. So cute. Okay, we're gonna put him on. Cause as you guys may know, Lido's representative animal is actually a chick. So it's pretty perfect. Okay, and then that's it. So now he has a chick on the side of his binder. I think it's really cute. And I want to like, instead of having beads, I want all of my A5 binders to have like a 3D little animal on it. So I think that's really, really cute. And that's what his binder looks like now. All right. And then we are going to do Ming Hao's one. So Ming Hao, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to cut off the charm that is already here and then I replace it with this frog charm that I bought. Alright, so again, removing the bead one. And then this is the frog charm that I'm going to put on. So I got this one from Etsy. You can see the at here and you can go check out their shop. This is not sponsored, um, but yeah, I think this frog charm is so cute. All right, so here it is. Really, really cute. This was about $3 and they also have a pink version. It's a little pink frog, but yeah, I got the green one. And let's put him onto the binder. I also say that I like this kind of string better than the, the beaded one that I put on Lido's. And 
and that's it that is the Minghao little froggy charm I think they're so cute and if you put them side by side now so now both the binders have a really really cute little charm on the side so yeah that is the first little update of my binders putting the charm on them and then now what we're going to do is we're going to store away some photo cards i'm going to start off with ming hao because ming hao doesn't have too many and then we will do the mass photo card storing of lido so let's get on to ming hao first Okay, so for Mingha, I have three photo cards to store away. I actually haven't done a photo card storing on camera of the Mingha binder yet, because for him, I pretty much just collect the photo cards that I vibe with, I guess. So the photo cards that I think are really, really pretty and that I just want to own. So I've got three different ones. I've got a Dream Tokyo pre-order. I've got a Face the Sun album photo card. And I've got a Carrot Land trading card. So let's flip through the Minghao binder. And we will go to the very last page. Which will be this page. It currently only has one uh, Horang Hei Minghao. So I will put this one here. Then I will put this one here. Then I will put Carrot Land Ming Hao here. So that is actually it for Ming Hao. Um, don't collect that many photo cards of him, but I'm really, really happy with the small collection that I have. Next up, we are going to move on to Lido. Okay, so for the Lido binder, I have so many photo cards to store away. I'll show you the pile. Um, a lot of these are pre-orders and I also collect all of his album photo cards. So I've got a lot of them that I traded my extras for. Um, okay, so I'll do the album ones first and I've split them up into their respective piles. So this is album. And this is non-album. Let's do album first. So if you guys remember a previous video that I did where I um, set up my Lido binder, I believe I do have spaces already prepared for all of the album photo cards. Alright, so I'm going to complete a lot of it today, by the way. So I think it will be really, really satisfying. First one we have is the Light Us concept photo. And he will go here. Then next up, we have both of the Raise Us photo cards. So these two got the Twilight version and the Dawn version. I think they go like this. All right, so that is the first page completed. Very, very exciting. Moving on to the next page, I have one photo card for Fly With Us. The other one I bought from Neoko and it's on the way. So this is the first one that I have. And I guess he will just go here. All right, so that is that for this page. Need one more here. And then in its times will complete as well. Next up, we have this page. I don't have any. I joined a group order for a devil and then lived. This one is coming in my Neo Cure order as well. So onto this page, we have binary code. So binary code, I have both of the photo cards. Very, very pretty on the back for this one. These were incredibly hard to find. I'm not sure why. I do have a friend who did uh, fan sign group order, but somehow she didn't have any left. Um, but yeah, I'm going to store away these two. And I do have a space here. I think I will actually put um, this photo card. So this photo card is from their season's greetings. 
it's not an album photo card but i don't really like having space here so since he also has blonde hair and the i guess the pose kind of matches i'm gonna put him here as well so okay that is that for this page we are powering through this then let's move on to blood moon all right so for blood moon i currently have three photo cards and i think what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put all of the ones with blonde hair on this page and all of the ones with black hair on the next page so i'm gonna store away these two first let's put them maybe just in these two slots and i have the final photo card coming from my friend i should have him by next week Okay, so that's that page complete. Let's do this page now. So for this page, I am going to put both of these. So I should go this way. Okay, so this is the proper blood moon. And this one is the, I guess it's the life is beautiful concept. So yeah, let's put these away. Okay, I think that looks better because now these two kind of match and then these two kind of match as well. So that is that for Blood Moon and One Us Theatre. Next page we have Trickstar. So for Trickstar, um, I bought the Digipack one and it's on the way, but for now I have the other album photo card. Okay, and I think that's actually it for album photo cards. I've finished Malice. And what we can do now is we can move on to non-album photo cards for Malice. Alright, so first up, we actually have a space here, and I said blonde hair, pre-order benefit. I'm going to move the season's greetings, actually. Yep, so this one, the season's greetings, I'm going to move over there. Um, and then this one... Okay, yes, so this one is technically Life is Beautiful pre-order benefit, but I'm going to put him here, since there's a space. Yep, it looks okay. Um, so moving back to Blonde Hair pre-order benefit, I'm going to put the season's greetings one here. Just so we can fill up a page. Cool, looks good. Then moving on to the next page, I think we just need to fill up all of the pre order benefits now. Okay, so basically what I've done is I've kind of arranged them in uh, the order of like what clothes he's wearing. So I think I really, really went overboard with um, how many photo cards I got. So these are all Malus pre-order benefits. I think definitely, because this was my first comeback, I wanted to buy a lot. Definitely, um, also because he has black hair. But for next few comebacks, it won't be my first comeback with them. And hopefully my boiling passion will have subsided a bit. So I won't go as hard getting all of these pre-order benefits. This one is from Dopamine. I'll put Dopamine aside for a bit. Okay, so I will just, um, yeah, I'll just go by outfit. So I could, I'll do these first four. So these ones are kind of like white t-shirt pre-order benefits. This one is a broadcast and this one was like really, really expensive. It's also one of my favorite ones. It's really, really close up. So yes, let's store these four away first. Okay, so that page is done. This is like the white t-shirt page. And then next page, let's do, what do I have next? I think I have like white jumper page. And I also have this one, so I guess he can also go here. Um, but why do I have a random, okay. 
So I have multiple of these. I think I will put this one aside and then we will store these four that kind of match. Yes. Okay, so actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the sets that I am pretty sure about. Um, so the first one is going to be this blue page. Um, so these three came as a set. I actually only wanted the chocolate one, but they came as a set anyway, so I got them. And then this is also blue. So I guess it kind of makes sense to have a blue page. Um, so I stored these ones away. Okay, so that is that for the blue malice page. And next up, I am going to put some extra sleeves in. Okay, I'm back with the pages. And next is going to be what I call my Halloween page. Um, so I've got two actual Halloween Parada benefits, both the in-person one, which is double-sided, I've also got my online one because my friend applied for the online fan sign. This one is has the really cute Halloween style back. Then I've got two pink Venom outfits, which I love pink Venom outfits. And then this is the back. So let's store these ones away. Okay, so that is that for the Halloween page. Next page we're going to do is what I like to call the comfortable jumper page. Um, so there's actually five. I think I will do like, I will do these four first. So basically in these ones, he's all wearing like comfortable jumpers. <laughs> I think it's really cute. I really like the hollow for this one. Then we just got some really, really cute ones as well. So yeah, let's store these ones away. All right, so that is that page. Next up, continuing on with the color scheme. Okay, I'm going to do these four first. So these four is also uh, black outfits. Um, so it goes from like comfy all the way to this one. So he was actually wearing this outfit for my fan sign with him, which I really like. That's why I desperately wanted this photo card. So let's store them like this. Okay. Okay, and then in these two, um, I think he's doing like rock, paper, scissors and the two moon sign. So I'm missing the rock and the scissors, but I can't really be bothered to get the other two. So I'm pretty happy just to have them. Okay, and then the final page for uh, Malus Pirata Benefits is this page. So there are two photo cards where he has this silver outfit which I love this silver outfit, by the way. And then two outfits where he has the uh, black blazer and the black mesh top on the inside. That's the back. Ooh. The backs are all pretty similar for these. So that's the final page of Malus Pre-Order Benefits. And then I do have some extras, just two extras. Um, so I've got this hollow one. This hollow one is from Black Mirror. Really, really love it. 
love how he's wearing glasses even when he wasn't my bias this is one of my favorite photo cards and then the other one i have is this kira kira one from dopamine so pretty uh this one was pretty expensive as well because it's a japan pre-order benefit so let's store these ones away Okay, so that is actually the end of storing away Lido photo cards. I think we can flip through this again just to see how much progress we've made. So just going to do a quick flip through. Um, I will do like an updated my entire collection video sometime. But definitely stored away a lot of photo cards today. And a lot of Malice Pro benefits. Definitely, I will be cutting back and not buying so many Pre-Order Benefits in the future. <laughs> but yeah, I'm really happy with what I have so far. And then just got some big cards and some bigger items. Okay, so that is that. Okay, so that is that for my photo card storing video today. I hope you enjoyed my little update of my A5 binders and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.